Why India's AMCA design is smarter than you think? Is it just another stealth jet, or has India designed something smarter than the rest? Let's decode the design philosophy of India's advanced medium combat aircraft. At first glance, AMCA looks sleek. A long fuselage, compact wings, twin engines. Its length is close to heavyweights like the F-22 or Su-57, but its wingspan and weight are more like the F-35 or China's J-35. That unique proportion, long and slim, is your first clue that AMCA's design is built for India's very specific needs. A longer fuselage with narrower wings means three big advantages. Supersonic efficiency. The slender body reduces drag at high speed, letting AMCA slice through the air more efficiently at Mach 1 plus. Internal weapons bay. The stretched fuselage gives more room for stealth weapon bays without fattening the wings, something the Su-57 struggles with. Fuel volume. India needs long-range reach across the Indian Ocean and deep along the northern borders. That extra fuselage length packs more internal fuel, meaning fewer refueling breaks and longer strike endurance. Maneuverability. Present but not emphasized. The current prototypes don't show canards, large wings, or thrust vectoring, which boost agility but compromise stealth. Now, look closely. Every line and edge on AMCA is parallel. That's not aesthetics. That's radar geometry optimization. It's diverterless supersonic inlets, DSI, like on the F-35, eliminate moving parts, fewer radar reflections, less maintenance. Its S-shaped ducts hide the engine blades, one of the biggest radar hotspots in older fighters. And those canted tails help balance radar deflection and control authority. A smart mix between F-35's stealth and Su-57's agility. In pure stealth terms, AMCA's frontal radar cross-section is expected to be between 0.001 and 0.005 square meters, roughly on par with the F-35, and significantly lower than the Su-57. Of course, stealth comes at a price. AMCA's narrow wings and absence of canards mean higher wing loading, less lift during sharp turns. So its baseline version, powered by the GEF-414 engine, won't be a dogfighting monster. It's more of a shoot-first-stay-hidden aircraft, designed to dominate in beyond-visual-range combat. But here's where it gets exciting. India's plan for a 120 kilonewton class engine. If that happens, AMCA's thrust-to-weight ratio jumps from around 1.0 to 1.2, on par with the F-22 and Su-57. Now add 3D thrust vectoring, and the story changes completely. Suddenly you've got post-stall control, high alpha maneuvers, and insane pitch control. Things stealth jets usually sacrifice. In short, AMCA evolves from stealth first to a stealth plus agility hybrid, capable of both long-range kills and close-in fights. If AMCA keeps its compact wings, low-speed turns remain limited. TVC helps, but wings still rule lift. So how does AMCA compare in actual combat scenarios? Beyond visual range, baseline AMCA is deadly. It's harder to detect than a Su-57 or J-35. Against the F-35, the contest is close. Both have low RCS, but the F-35's sensor fusion gives it a small edge in situational awareness. Against the J-35 and Su-57, AMCA likely shoots first, thanks to cleaner stealth shaping and disciplined emission control. Within visual range, Without thrust vectoring, AMCA struggles against the Su-57's agility, and even J-35 or J-20 in some scenarios. With the 120 kilo Newton class engine and 3D thrust vectoring, the tables turn. Simulations suggest instantaneous turn improves by approximately 15 to 20 percent, sustained turn by approximately 10 to 15 percent, post-stall recovery almost doubles in speed. In short, it can fight vertically, Engage briefly and break away fast. A classic hit-and-run stealth tactic. It won't match Su-57's raw agility. Bigger wings, more lift. But it would be close to F-22 class balance. Stealth, supercruise, and agility. The future of air combat isn't just about who can turn faster. It's about who sees first, who strikes first, and who disappears first.
AMCA's Sensor Fusion, AI-assisted cockpit, and future loyal wingman drones make it not just a fighter, but a networked command node in the sky. Still, WVR combat won't disappear entirely, and that's where the new engine plus thrust vectoring combo gives AMCA an insurance policy. Stealth for survival, agility for the unexpected. Here's the part most people miss. AMCA's outer skin will be modular stealth panels, radar-absorbing layers that can be swapped or upgraded without changing the airframe. That means lower maintenance costs than F-35 and better longevity. Stealth you can service instead of replace. So in summary, base AMCA. Stealth first, efficient, surgical. Upgraded AMCA. Stealthy, fast, and deadly agile. India's AMCA may not be the loudest in design, but it's smart. A perfect reflection of India's defense philosophy. Balanced, adaptive, and quietly lethal. 